poppin' YouTube, it's the King checking in from work. I wasn't gonna bring you a bit of these because obviously there are hundreds of them on YouTube already. But the reason I am is to show you the crap quality that JB continues to put out there. It's absolutely ludicrous that Jordan Brand and Nike continue to put out mind-bogglingly poor quality craftsmanship products to the public. I mean, like I said, I'm at work. I just opened up my shipment. I started checking them out, and it's like, what? I don't. I really don't understand. It's it's unbelievable. Let's start off with the left shoe. I mean, obviously there are glue stains all over the place. So hopefully the camera focuses properly. I know you can see that big glue stain right there. Uh, the glue stains all over the place. The coating that they put on the leather is already starting to chip and peel away right there, as you can see. The paint is not lined up properly. Like, it's not lined up properly. More glue stains. I know you can see that. Glue stains. Look, look the paint's not lined up properly. More glue stains. More glue stains. I mean, this is absolutely ridiculous. Let's get to the worst offender. Uh, the paint is already smudged so hopefully this focuses like right there where my, right where my fingers at the paint is already smudged Let's see if I can right there obviously more glue stains the paint the worst part alright you can see blue right there on the gray blue on the gray right there it's clearly noticeable. It's, it's very noticeable. And the worst part is this part right here. Like, hold on. Let me see if I can get this to focus. That part right there. It looks like the blue is licking the gray. I mean, come on, man. I know I'm probably not the only one that has issues like this. But that shouldn't be the case. Uh, Jordan Brand is charging what ten, twenty dollars more than last year for a remastered product, and they're still putting out crap like this. It's it's ludicrous. It's ridiculous. It's mind boggling, mind blowing, utterly unbelievable. Uh, and then when you talk to Nike uh, over the phone or on Twitter, they ask you where you got it from. They ask you, oh, well, you can bring it back in and we'll try and uh, exchange it for you. No, you can't exchange it for me because the majority of the shoes, 9 times out of 10, are sold out already. So you can't give me another shoe. Oh, well, we'll give you a credit. I don't want a credit. I just want the shoe. That's all I want is a shoe. Why are we paying more for this type of craftsmanship? I thought this was supposed to be better, a better quality product, yet we still keep getting baloney crap like this. It's It's unbelievable. Thanks for watching, guys. This is my little rant. Um, I got a couple more vids coming up. I just haven't had time to put them together. Uh, I appreciate all you guys again. Thanks for watching. Uh, peace out, familia. I'll catch you on the next one.